Hey everyone, today I've got a little tip for you about Mac OS X Lion. Now, if you have used Lion for any amount of time, you'll know that when you go to the Apple logo menu and click shutdown or something like that, it gives you this little dialog box and it says reopen windows when logging back in. There's a little checkbox. Now, personally, I don't like that checkbox at all. Um, I'm not a huge fan of the new resume feature in Lion, so I end up always unchecking it before I click shut down. I find this a little bit annoying, but there's a way that you can make this checkbox completely useless. Um, it'll still show up, so when you go to shut down, it'll still show up, but no matter what you do, if you leave it checked or unchecked, it's not going to do anything. So to make this work, you're going to have to go into terminal. So the easiest way to find terminal is just to click on spotlight up in the top and type in terminal. And you can click on terminal, and from here, you're going to see your little window and you're going to have to paste a line of code into here. Now rather than saying the code or displaying it on the screen, uh, it's pretty much useless to do because it's a very long uh, string of text. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to have it listed right below the video. So here it is right here, you can see it's a very long string. And uh, I'm just going to copy this string and I'm going to paste it right here and I'm going to hit enter. And it's going to ask you for your password and I'm just going to type in my little password, you're not going to see any characters or anything. And now it's going to look like nothing happened. Uh, but what it actually did is it downloaded a little script and it ran the script basically disabling that resume checkbox. So I'm going to close everything up here and I'm going to set up a little test scenario. I'm going to open up Safari, I'm going to open up a whole bunch of new tabs here. And these are all going to be open. And I'll open up system preferences maybe and a finder window. And let's try something like image capture and quick time player and maybe text edit again. We're going to have all this stuff open. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to shut down the Mac and I'm going to leave the reopen windows when logging in checkbox enabled. And we're going to restart it and see what happens. So you can see here now that the only thing that seemed to resume on startup was the finder window. So, so it's a little bit interesting that that did actually resume. But you can see none of the other stuff I had open, like Safari and Image Capture, QuickTime Player, none of that stuff is open now. So you can see that the script did work. Now the nice thing about this script is that you can disable it as well. So if I go back in the terminal and I take this other line of code here, which I'll also have right below the video, and I copy this and I paste it right into the terminal. What it's going to do is it's going to reverse the script that I just put in. It's going to ask me for my password once again. And it looks like nothing happened, but you'll see that everything will resume once again after you shut down and restart. So there you go, that's an easy way to disable the resume checkbox on the shutdown screen on your Mac. And as always, if you have anything that you'd like to see me do a how to on, make sure to send me an email. I hope you found this video useful, and thank you for watching. Oh, <laughs>